The labyrinth is this. It is this life, this experience in the body. The voyaging being uses the machine to navigate through the labyrinth. The labyrinth is all around, all encompassing and mostly invisible in the sleeping state. Driving down the street, one decision to make a left turn is a path. A new doorway with infinite possibilities ahead. The impulse to stop at a coffee shop is another. We cannot travel in all directions at once. Only one path can be voyaged at a time. And each action takes the being up or down to the right or to the left through time in the multi-dimensional labyrinth. Just imagine a vast labyrinth with its multitude of choices. Its many paths spill forward with promise. But the The place you want to get to is the inner courtyard. You cannot just hop walls. The path must be walked. And sometimes, when it seems you are descending, seemingly far away from the goal, It is because you are walking a non-linear path which may ultimately bring you closer to the heart. Your ancestors did not believe in a uniform absolute time. He believed in an infinite series of time, in a growing, dizzying net of divergent, convergent, and parallel times. This network of times which approached one another, forked, broke off, or were unaware of one another for centuries, embraces all possibilities of time. We do not exist in the majority of these times. In some you exist and not I. In others, I and not you. In others, both of us present one, which a favorable fate has granted me. You have arrived at my house, in another, while crossing the garden, you found me dead. In still another, I utter these same words, but I am a mistake, a ghost. Time crosses and recrosses, and one time lives in another.